I am doing this so everybody knows that the February box has been found and this is what has happened. Now we all need to remember what Jesus did and that was to forgive. And we need to forgive too and show her what Christ's love is so you all don't get mad. Okay, this video is going to be about the February box. Come on, ladies. Where's the block box? Uh, somebody needs to step and let us know where the box is. I was the first to send it forward from California, and I've been looking forward to seeing what happened into the box. Sandy put a lot of work into organizing this little project for all of us to have fun. You could at least call her and, or send her a note letting her know what happened. That is so unfair to her after all she does for us. She works very hard making videos for us to enjoy and learn from, and she deserves better than this. I'm so sorry for the happen. Love, love you. Hugs and kisses. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'll be okay, though. Like I said, if they can live with it, I can live without it. It's just unfortunate people was not able to get to see the box and have fun going through it. But thing, things in it now, I'm glad you got it. Your, my oldest dis, uh, describer, or supposed to be subscriber, as far as I can remember, that wanted to do it. Hugs and kisses. I hope somebody comes forward now with the re uh, this reminder to them. I'm not sure the only one, me too, it's not fair for the ones that did not get a chance to do it. I have to agree, Sandy, you did it. Didn't you say Sonya was the last one you talked to that had it? Maybe she talked to Sonya and see where she sent it, and maybe she can track it from there. All right, I did not get this comment, so I did not get to reply to that one. All right. Well, that's not what I wanted. Now, come on now. I hate it when this thing don't do what I want it to do. All right, there. Oh, it's going to do it again. Okay, I got to figure this thing out. <laughs> I'm not used to doing it on my phone, okay? Quit. Comments. Now, stroll down. Maybe COVID-19 stopped it. I do not think COVID-19 stopped it because it come right out. I think I'm supposed to say LOL to that. Yes, because COVID-19 came out right after I sent that box to um, California. So... It was right after Liz got the box. She was able to send it from her house to the next person and then COVID come up. I'm going to look that up and find out when COVID started. Like I said, let's forgive and forget. We'll get the box back and if not, oh well. But COVID came out in 19. That's why they call it COVID-19. So it's been almost a year. So please remember, we need to forgive. COVID-19 started in, in not the 2019. So let me see what else we got here. I think this is going to be easier. I don't know. Is it going to be easier for me to get to these? Oh, come on now. I am not going to say who it is, but however, I will read. Sorry this happened. Maybe it was a misunderstanding. I hope someone would, wouldn't would steal from a mystery box sent to bring joy. We've got two, and it says, I hope it's a misunderstanding too, but I have not heard from you for months about 
three months now, it seems like. I feel bad about it, too. Hopefully, it is a misunderstanding. I hope they come forward and say they, hey, I got the box, and this happened. And also, we can hopefully get it again. Hugs and kisses. So, you know, see, that's the reason why... I, and it goes back to that. See, I, I'm having trouble with this. All right. Uh, dead on, Sandy. I'm so sorry people feel the need to steal. Amen. I got it and passed it on. All right. So, so far, this is the way that it looks. That you, that you were the one that stole the box. Why? Because you never even... it. Look, this right here was two months ago that she, that she put this one on. Let's go on. It says, I cannot find tracking number I had sent to Sandy. I will look for it when I get back home. Won't be home till the end of the month. Alright, here's another two months ago. Oh, I'm sorry. Somebody did this. Oh, no. I sure hope it gets back. To, I'm not really seeing anything in, bad at all that anybody has said. Nobody. Um, I sent it to New York. The person got it and kept checking, and I saw it make it to them. She should have said something to you. And I'm not for sure who she sent it to or anything. We got two replies. Um, I tracked the, bo the box to Yancey. Tracking number. She gave me that. And I sent the box to her. Tracking shows she got it. Alright. So, that's where the tracking so far has went. And I'm hitting the wrong button. That's the reason. I am so sorry this happened. I'm not seeing anybody downing you. Oh, when I saw the title, I was hoping it finally made it back to you. I'm sorry, Sandy. Hope it's a misunderstanding or miss something. Everybody is saying, I hope it's a misunderstanding. Nobody ain't saying anything bad. Hey, sweetie, that's sad. Someone would do this but like you said, God knows they did it, and he's going to be their judge. It's pure shame someone would take what was meant for good to be to be so evil. <coughs> God bless you and Rick's and hugs and kisses. Now, I have to say on this one, <coughs> I have to agree with her. The, uh, the thing of it was, was all you had to do was get in contact with me and say, this and this happened, and I have the box, and now I, I, I can't, I, I'm having a lot of difficulty. And you could have spoke up, and we all could have gotten together and helped you get the box back to me. Or even help you financially. I don't know how it would have worked. But it's not working the way you want to now. It's not where all of us are upset over this. Alright, let's go on. It says, Hey, Sandy. I know the two is between Yancey that should have it. I'll send them to you. At least you know it's one or the other. It's a shame it went so far in between so many other honest people for it to get close to getting to you. <coughs> Only two people were left after Yancey got it. And we know she did because Sonia has the info. It was definitely received. So if she hasn't sent it between the three that have it, I sent you their name, so it has to be between the three left. I'm sorry this happened. Alright, so, if you can already tell, Yancey is the one that says 
that she has. I think I I hope I'm saying your name right. Okay. All right. Let's see what else we got here. Um, when my children were little, I would tell them the same thing, as I was told when I was very young. I don't know if you are telling me the truth. However, God does. Hopefully, it was all a misunderstanding, Sandy. I love your your generous heart. Thank you. I appreciate that. I have to say, yeah, and, and the Bible says that you hope your sins find you out. Now, I'm going to tell you how I feel about all of this. All right, good video, sis hugs from Pam. I think that's it. All right, let's, so let's go down here. So this was two months ago. Oh, right, Lord, right here. Okay, you cannot see it. Let's go up. See, two months ago. So really, there's been more than two months go by that this box has not seen anything and everybody's saying i hope it's a misunderstanding i hope it's a and yeah i was hoping the same thing that it was a misunderstanding if you would have said something to us maybe we could have helped you okay so now everybody knows anyway so i was going to keep it quiet but since there's so many on there that says it 24 minutes ago, I had the box. I have had it for a long time. In the meantime, I lost my mother. I am sorry that you've lost your I know what that feels like. It's You have an empty spot. And you have to give it time for it to fill up. Alright, COVID-19 started in... 2019 and today's date is uh, let's get that date up tuesday well i don't tuesday september the 29th so as i it's 2020 so let's make sure we put that in there okay so um you can't use covert as a a clutch because that's not going to work on my part i don't see it that way maybe if it would have happened in 2019 maybe i might have let could say okay i can understand that but right now on this covert 19 i cannot now i am not telling you to unsubscribe i'm not let's put it this way Time heals all wounds, and it's going to heal this wound as well. So, in other words, forgiveness is on the agenda to come, okay? I don't want you to unsubscribe if you like my channel. I'm leaving it totally up to you. If that's what you want to do, you go for it. If you want to send a box, you go for it. If you don't want to send a box, you go for it. Whatever you want to do. My love for you will not change. Because the Lord Jesus Christ said, If you cannot forgive, how can I forgive? So yes, I am going to forgive. Alright. I have had many financial problems. Hey look, everybody is going through this financial problems. And I'm going to be honest and truthful with you. I know there's times that you probably don't eat. I know there's times that I don't eat. And I'm saying that all, that all, this, that all the subscribers here, all these family members here, there are some days that, or some meals that they have to skip because they don't have the money. I have to do the same thing. And my body, it's changing. It's really changing. All right, no income means no internet. Oh, to let you know, uh, okay, we, we can handle this. We can handle this. 
Um. All right, I'll be right back. Okay. But however, if you look in the box and in that uh, aluminum can that's in there, it has my phone number. Just because you did not have the internet did not mean that you could not have picked up the phone and said, hey, I have the box. This is what's going on. And you, you know what would have been said to you? Hey, wait till you can do it. Wait till you can do it. Because we are not hardcore people on here. We want to be forgiving people. Because that's the way God wants us to be. Okay? So, we can understand you not having the internet to let us all know. But there was a phone number in there. And you could have called that phone number. I have not... <coughs> <clears throat> they have not changed that phone number. It is still the same. However, I'm ashamed at the comments. I would not be too much ashamed at the comments because we all didn't know. And we all are... I mean, what would you think if it was your box? The same thing. Somebody stole the box and somebody lied to us. How dare you assume? Well, we ha we, what else could we assume? We have nothing else to go by. You had a phone number and you didn't call us. Uh, see, I have the damn thing and I have it ready to go. It just has not been on the top of my list. Well, with your mother dying and your husband losing his job, I can kind of understand that. But the question is, is how many months did you have the box with the phone number in there that you could have called us? You know? Okay. I don't know when I will be able to get it out, but I will. I will send it directly to Sandy. Shame on you all for assuming I was going to just keep the box of junk. Well, to us, that box of junk that you call it, and all was something that we all went into and, and wanted to do together. And you wanted to do it. So, you really, honestly, and truthfully, if you want to get right down to the nitty gritty of it all, you could have made a phone call, a short phone call, and said, Hey, I have the box. And this is what's been going on. Then that way, we could have helped you. But in this time of a trouble, right now, I don't see anybody helping you. Because there was no excuse. And if you send the box back, I would appreciate it and everybody else would too. But if you don't want to send the box back and you want to throw it in the trash, you go right on ahead. The, the, the call is on you on how you want to continue this. Now, like I said, we are forgiven people here. Jesus Christ said if we do not forgive, he cannot forgive us. So it really has to start with you. And you understand what we went through. Because you are not the only one that goes through and loses their mother and loses their job or loses their vehicle or loses their house. You're not the only one going through the trouble here. We are all going through hard times right now. And this covert thing, you everybody ought to already know that that right there is not going to be an excuse. If you want to go around and and have a diaper on your face, you go right on ahead. But me, myself, I want to be able to breathe fresh air when I breathe fresh air. Now, all of it's up to you. And everybody else, they can leave their comment if they want to. But I am going, I, I am going to let them know. And I want everyone to see it. And see 
I wasn't going to say anything. But everybody was pointing towards you. So I said, well, if they're going to point towards her, they already know. And I'm going to show them what she wrote. All right. The ball's in your court. Whatever you do, you do. I still wish you the very best. And I hope that you find the real, truthful Jesus Christ. Because he forgives. And we will too. Okay, just as I was fixing to put this up, it says, I apologize for my comment. But as I explained, I was penniless. Hardly had food. I am a recent cancer su survivor and had many other things going on. I had no way to contact you. No internet, no computer, nothing. Sorry, I have run your box. So our box is run. So we're not going to expect it back. But I do feel for her. And I hope you guys will find the forgiveness in your heart for her. Just as I'm going to work on that too. But love can conquer all. Jesus Christ love will help us and we can forgive and hopefully forget because that's what I'm going to work on all right I almost put it on without it but just to, I cut it off so I could get it and show you what her last one was so I pray that the Lord Jesus Christ will help her in her hard times because we are going to get more. I'm running out of room here to talk. All right, forgive her.